All right. I think all of the bullcrap is settled. So, my PC decided to randomly stop recognizing my microphone again. It likes to do that. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to move the screen a little bit to fit this puppy in here. So this is LSD for anybody who's watching the VOD and has never played LSD or never seen it. Most of you probably never played it. Oh, every time with this. It's an old PlayStation 1 game that is very reminiscent of a more modern uh, walking sim, as many would call it. It's just kind of an exploration game where you see a bunch of crazy stuff and uh, try to enjoy yourself. And I enjoy it very much. And I think you'll find it's a very interesting and chill thing to... Uh, to see. Hey, Unplugged! So this is an old Japanese PS1 game, and do we have audio? Hold on. I think my HDMI is muted. Oh, wait, maybe this is just always silent. Hello? Fish. Yes, fish is me. Okay, there's supposed to be noises on this thing, I think. Let's just start. I can't... Uh, what's going on with the audio? It's always something. It's always something. Okay, all right. Oh, what? Oh, oh, oh. These speakers. What are you doing? What? You gotta be kidding me. What? Yeah, what? Why are you not making noise? God damn it. Um, hold on. What is this bullcrap? That is outputting to that. HDMI in. Listen to this device. Wait, why is it muted? Okay. Why was that muted? I'm just gonna blame Windows 10, because Windows 10 likes to change settings randomly sometimes. Anyway. Hey, son. Hey, Gates drummer. Um... Alright, that's the beautiful noises that I'm used to hearing. Alright, let me know if this is a little too loud. It doesn't look like it in the, in the balancer, though. So, this is what LSD looks like. Um... Uh oh, no, 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 ah! Oh wait, I have a map, hold on. Let me bring up my map on my other screen here. Hey, Artie. All right, got my map. Oh, Muxybot is still adding everyone. I thought I told it to not mention everyone. Well, I think it just revoked its privilege to, to do so, but it, I don't know if that actually hits everyone or not. What the? Did it just crash? Of course it crashed! Uh, uh, that's That just makes complete sense. So, when I started this, um, it turns out... I have a new HDMI um, splitter, and it does not strip HDCP. My old ones all did. So what I had to do is plug in my PS3 to my old HDMI splitter, which is breaking down, and like it's really sensitive, and if it's not in the right exact position, it stops working. Um, but, so I, I had to do some audio video crap, then for some reason my microphone wasn't working. I, I'm still not entirely sure what happened there, and my audio settings in general were all messed up. Um, and now, of course, the game crashed, but that's pretty normal. This game just does actually crash, it's not an emulation thing. This is the official, this is the PS1 version running on the PS3. Uh, you can buy it from the Japanese PlayStation Store. Oh boy. Now this is this is the original. You can tell by I mean it's extremely easy to tell really. All right, let's listen to this masterpiece this time. I think the Matrix is about to start playing. It's just a bike. It's a, it's a stamp with a bike biker guy on it. This is the most dramatic video anyone has ever made of a stamp. That's facts. 
That's facts. I don't know what that was supposed to be, but beautiful, thank you. So, let's just get back going. Um, other than the mess of trying to set up for the stream, which is always a mess, um, it's been a pretty good day. So, at work, at the end of yesterday, a bunch of, like, four different, um, issues got dumped on my desk all at once. Let's go to the birds. Um, and I saw two of those today at least. Not quite back up to speed entirely, but not too bad of a day at work. I did get my, um, this was surprisingly quick too, but I got my website working as a progressive web app. Which means, basically means you can add it to your Android or, you know, your phone. And the pages can work offline. Um, it works more like a native app than like a web thing, which is pretty neat. And it, it's, it's snappier too. Heck, that's a YouTube link. Why is it? If you copy it from Google... Oh my god, there's lasers happening. Oh wait. Oh, that's the nuke! Hello, Mr. Nuke. It's been a while! Oh, look at that dithering. Beautiful. We missed the 4th of July, but we're making up for it. We sure are making up for it. Alright. What was I saying? Oh yeah, but my website's now a progressive web app, so if you use like my Abyssrium guide a lot, you can add it to your home screen, and uh, it'll download offline, and you can uh, mess with it there. It's pretty cool, and it was surprisingly a little work on my hand, um, on my on my behalf or whatever I was trying to say there. I figured it would require a lot of coding and fancy JavaScript and stuff, but nah. It does require browser support or like operating system support, but. Uh, it works on any modern-ish Android and um, probably eventually Safari and so on. Um, so that was cool. Also, YouTube... I don't know exactly what happened, but YouTube seems to have killed Alex Maurer's uh, illegal DMCA claims. Again. Oh yeah, the PS1 wobbly polys work so well for this game. It's beautiful. Even the draw distance is kind of part of the aesthetic. But, um, anyway, Alex Maurer's your claim on my video is gone, so I can stream again. I'm gonna give Twitch, like, a few weeks or a month, and I'm gonna see how I like it. Um, I'm not gonna go right back to YouTube, because the last time I went right back to YouTube, I got it's legally DMCA claimed on the same exact video, and it got taken down, and just, right as I was ready to celebrate all of the bullshit being over, the bullshit came right back. Bullshit is never over. Uh, and in fact, I found this beautiful image showing exactly exactly how I feel on this um, this particular topic. This is this has to be one of the best YouTube videos of all time. But just oh, why is it so low res? Oh, that's so bad. Why is it low res? Hold on. This this face deserves much higher resolution. There we go. There you go. Here are my thoughts on the bullshit. You can you can you can see her thoughts already. She doesn't need to speak. You can tell. It's it's a thing of beauty. All right. Let's get back to the game. This is getting me horse simulator. Horse tranquilizer simulator. Oh, I was actually streaming at 60 FPS last time. I was streaming, I turned down the, the FPS to 30 because, yeah, this game does not have good frame rates. Most PS1 games did not. Yeah, Alex, uh, YouTube seems to have wised up. Um, just today, uh, Star Mazer's YouTube got taken down, and they got him back up within 12 hours. Uh, within 8 hours or less, I think, actually. Um, there's the sun. It's red. Don't worry about that. Um, so my video is back up. Star Mazer's thing is back up. I don't know if all of the videos are back. Um, and YouTube, it was really weird because YouTube gave me a different um, thing that said, hey, your video is no longer claimed, whatever. And then all of a sudden they replied to my support case saying, oh, uh, it looks like this issue is no has been resolved already. And that's kind of weird because the first... I've mailed them four times over the last three weeks. They did not reply at all until today, an hour after that video went back up. Oh, let's watch a missile again. I don't know why we keep coming back here. 
Um, they, I, I got a message. Uh, they answered both of them, actually. Uh, well, two of the four, anyway. And, um, it was weird. But, uh, I don't know if, if the whole DMCA situation is completely done. But, um, what a good boon for- oh. I thought that was just a chunk that didn't load yet, because Minecraft has trained my brain to just expect large chunks to just not appear. Anyway, this is a boring texture set, so we're just gonna die. Um, I don't know if it's entirely over, and I'm gonna wait to post a video celebrating or anything, because I know what happened last time. I'm gonna wait for like a, a week or two at this point. But, um... Yeah, that's about all the more I want to talk about that that crap. Hopefully it's all over with. Um, yeah, now here I am playing some LSD. Ah, here we go. These are some good colors. Look at this, you can go inside the buildings. It's better than Grand Theft Auto. I remember when that was the, the absolute most important quality of a game. Can you go inside the buildings? DATA 3, you can't go inside the buildings, bad game. Um, San Andreas, you could go inside the buildings, but only a few. And just like, for year, like, well not years, but like, I don't know, for a while this was just the entire discourse in gaming. Can you go inside the buildings? No? It's not a good game. And they, um... There was also that thing where terrain deformation was going to be the whole thing forever. And then that one game, like, what even was that game called? There was this game that was supposed to have revolutionary terrain, whatever thing, and no one... I, I, I don't even remember it coming out. I played a demo for it. It was very underwhelming. I want to say it was like, nah, I forget what the hell it was. But, uh, yeah. Huh. There's no NPCs wandering around here. I like when there's... That's one. That's the biggest thing I miss in LSD Revamped, is the lack of NPCs. Even though there's not that many in the game, they still add a lot to it. <laughs> oh, that's kind of funny. The, um... Ah! That's not funny at all. Um... Oh no, you fucker! Fuck you! Fuck your face off. I'm gonna get hit by a train. That guy is bad news if you haven't seen this game before. Oh good, the train is coming. Free me. Free me from my torment, Mr. Train! Um, yeah, that guy like, reverses your progress somewhat. <laughs> but, oh yeah, so Twitch, it's net neutrality day, so a lot of websites are like, you know, loading slow and posting loading spinners and being like, hey, mail your congressman, tell them not to be a complete idiot and uh, support net neutrality. Um, what Twitch is doing is making all of the emojis have been replaced with loading spinner GIFs. Um, <laughs> but the funny thing is my chat thing actually is ignoring that. That's not intentional or anything, that's just what the chat thing happens to do. Um, is this the Space Needle? What is this? What is this garbage? That is the Space Needle. What, why is the Space Needle in, like, Kyoto? Is is the Space Needle in Kyoto? Is Seattle in Japan? I think... I don't know, I'm not the best at the geographies, but I'm not sure if that's correct. I can't believe this game. I can't... wait, hold on. I think I found this out before, but I don't... Digital mode? Analog? Can I use the analog stick? I cannot. That actually disables... If you put it on digital mode, it disables the, 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 the D-pad too. That is so weird! But yeah, the, the, using the PlayStation 3 D-pad kind of makes me die. Well, at least for 3D games. I guess it's not really just the PS3 D-pad. Um, but it's just kind of using just that whole PlayStation 1 D-pad in 3D thing. Very painful. Tap tap moment number 439. What, what do tap tap moments entail? I'm afraid to ask. Look at these beautiful cherry blossoms. Look at that. Look at their majesty. So beautiful and detailed. You can just almost smell it. Can, can you smell the cherry blossoms? Amazing. Let's go to the face. Oh, never mind. We're going to the tree. 
If this world was like this, I'd want to be hit by a train too. Slime Rancher suddenly got weird. I didn't leave it as Slime Rancher, did I? No, it says it says LSD. Oh no. Woo! This is like a, this is the start of a rave with all of these whistles. Tap tap moments until fuck that guy. I'm gonna hit by a train. Well, I mean, you you if if you had to choose between the gray man and getting getting hit by a train, personally, I think the train is preferable. This is like a rave song that never gets started. Whoa, the pink void, beautiful. Is this is this vaporwave? I don't. The music is not quite vaporwave, but visually, I mean, there's Japanese text. There's blue, there's pink, there's low-res PS1 graphics. Aside from the music, we're Vaporwave. I'd play some Vaporwave, but I don't want to get content ID'd. Oh, hey, Capitalist and BP, by the way. So what's in this floor? Oh, nothing today. Wait, is this the floor that's always empty? There's one thing that has... There's one floor that's always empty, and there's one floor that has... stuffs. Okay, this is the empty one. Whatever. If you have good moments for, like, a highlights reel or anything, just let me know in the video or whatever. Like, just give a timestamp. That can actually help a lot if I were ever to make, like, a highlights video. I like the idea of making highlights videos, but the main problem is, is that they required me to watch whatever like, if I did a two-hour stream, I would have to watch the entire two-hour stream again. Pick out the good bits, edit them all together, and... It's like, even if I know what to cut up, editing a two-hour stream is a pain. If I don't know what to cut to cut up, it's not. And so I don't remember the good bits when I'm streaming, because I'm... You know, I'm trying to focus on doing the streaming. I kind of wish I had, like, a foot pedal where I could just, like, beep it whenever something good happened. But then I would probably never remember to do, to do it. Do you know if when hit people hit clip? Um, I don't know if it shows me when people make clips of my stuff. I guess we do have Twitch clips again. So I guess, though the problem with Twitch clips is they're not very good. Like, uh, at least I could not understand like how Twitch clips work. Cause like I was trying to capture a very specific moment and I tried making a clip at the very start of it. Nope, I tried making a clip at the end of it. Nope, it didn't contain all of it. it I, I just don't I just, no! I'm gonna go ahead and get hit by the train. Oh no. Oh please no. This is Oh no. Okay, we're gonna go get, get hit by the train again. It's it's it'll be quicker guys. It's it's fine. You gotta click at the end of it? I think I tried that though. It didn't seem to work. Or maybe I I don't know. I'll try that next time I guess. Ooh, mushrooms! Is it safe to take mushrooms if you're on LSD? Oh, I guess we'll never know. Clips only keep track of a 30 second interval. Oh, I know they're only 30 seconds. But like, I was trying to make a very specific clip and it just did not work no matter what I tried. Yeah, I guess since we're on Twitch, we can do the clip thing. So that actually makes it easier for you at least. I don't know if you have to send me the clips though. Like, can you see where what clips people have made of you? Oh my god, no. It's time to get hit by a train again, my children. Which will hit me first. Place your bets. Where is that train? I demand to get hit by this train. Hit me, train. Train. Does, does the train not happen? If, unless you don't, like, go in. BEANS! Did you see that? That was BEANS! We got hit by the bean train. <laughs> Why did it say BEANS? I, I can't believe we just took a ride on the beans train, face first. You can have over 30 seconds on a Twitch clip? I think if you clip it now, it'll actually grab at least some of it. Oh hey, Pride Month is over, but it's never too late for Pride, so let's go to the Pride statue, man. Yeah, we just got beaned. 
I love the whistle. It, it always sounds like a freaking really happening house track is about to burst in, but it never starts. That's what all of this music is. All of this music is an intro that just never, never gets going. Woo! I like when you just go fast. Sometimes you just gotta go fast. Oh, and speaking of my technical issues, just adding to them, my controller was also out of battery. So I'm playing plugged in right now. And charging PS3 controllers is weird. Uh, they don't seem to want to charge except for the PS3 itself. Unless they're already on, or I don't know. Oh, these are some good faces. We're in a pretty good texture set. Oh, Mr. Turtle Man! How are you doing? Oh, I wonder what the bean strain looks like with these textures. Hello, Mr. Landshark. Oh no! Oh, we're waking up! Oh no, we just got the good textures, please! Ugh. That, that, that face looks like horrible things have happened to it. Alright, we gotta save. I keep forgetting to save. That's bad, because this game does crash. A lot. Fish. What should our name be? We need a new name. Febchk. It's gonna start with a consonant. We're gonna go with... <laughs> kfc -sh. Yes, KFC-ish. That's good. Oh, we got beans clip? Thank you. It said beams? I, I reject that reality. My headcanon is that it said beans. Uh oh. Uh, we're in that kind of good texture area. We're not quite all the way. But this is one of those areas that isn't really super fun. Though I don't, I'm not sure I've seen this exact color pat. Oh crap! It is so easy to bump in to the thing. It said beams. Mixer strikes back. Ooh, now we're talking. Oh god! Hold on. No mute. There we go. Ah, uh, I can't believe we had these beautiful textures and then that horrible noise, but whatever. Ah, oh, look at these. This kind of reminds me of the textures from like an Inside the Body game. I think it was, uh, I actually found it and downloaded it. It was like Body 3D or something. And um, I think we're off the horrible noise texture. Yes. Oh, what's the train gonna say this time? I'm excited. You actually have to go into the tunnel to spawn the train. It's ridiculous. Wait. No? Okay. What? That just ends the day? Okay. The Dark Souls of sound effects. So much Dark Souls discourse going on. Whoa. Was there always Japanese on that? I don't remember there being words. Huh. Let's go to Egypt. <laughs> and tag beans. Oh, we're inside the building again. Suck it, GTA. There we go. Oh, the sun is back to normal-ish. Actually, the sun shouldn't really be orange either. It's kind of weird how often the sun is literally anything other than white in, like, fiction and stuff. The sun is definitely not orange. Whoa. Mr. Foxman! Wait, where'd you go? There's floating doggos. Come back! They're everywhere! The town is overrun by doggos. Net neutrality doesn't affect mobile. That's kind of a dumb choice, because, like, net neutrality's um, effects will probably affect mobile even more than desktop, so... They should really hammer it into the mobile users. Okami 4.0.4, 4, exactly. I love the... I love how you just think that these are warp textures because of PlayStation 1, but you get close and it's like, oh, it's actually like that. Though some of them just are warped because PS1. I think this is an effect you can replicate in um, in more modern 3D applications too, if you try. 
I'm sort of disappointed there hasn't been too many games going for PS1 aesthetic. There was back in 1999, which was, uh, or 95, which was a really good idea, but they kind of, uh, they kind of half ass. oh god. There's two of them now! Oh, there's two of them. Oh, I have to see my crazy house textures. Oh, my house is meat. Look, my house is delicious meat with hell windows. The hell windows really bring it together, don't they? You know, a house isn't really a home until it's got a hell window in it. I've got some nice Satan walls. Oh, there's eyes! Wait, there's eyes, hands, and arms in my, uh, my liquor cabinet. <laughs> what are those? I just got one question for you. What are those? Oh, the floor is meat again. The meat floor is my favorite. Why did you walk so slowly? This is the, that, that, that entire thing was an unskippable animation. That was the slowest he's ever gone. What's in the box? Oh, there's nothing. But you gotta love these like synapses all over the floor. Why is it so slow? It's painful. Oh man. Ooh. I got some art over here. Oh. Nobody's in the bed today. I guess the third floor is the one with all of the crazy crap. The second floor is very disappointing. Aw, oh, the murder book. Wait, no, I gotta go upstairs just in case Mr. Face Man is in the uh in the fireplace. Oh, this reminds me, something reminded me anyway. I have, um, Pokemon, I have Hey You Pikachu, oh, he's not in there. Just some hands in the bookshelf, what's the water? The water closet is just kind of a warped texture of the water closet. Um, do, do they actually call it a water closet in Japan, by the way? Like, I've never, I've never heard that expression before. Oh, this, yeah, I think the weird foghorn thing means the astronaut man is out there. I could edit compilations for you for free for everyone to enjoy. I mean, if you want to edit crap together, I guess. Be my guest. I probably wouldn't do that myself, honestly. But yeah, Hey You Pikachu will eventually happen. The, the problem with Hey You Pikachu is I think I'll have to use my old Elgato. Um, and that might have lag. Though I might actually... I think I might be able to output it through HDMI through my old Elgato, and then input that HDMI into my usual HDMI recording setup, and then I could see it. So... I'm not sure if that would still have lag. I don't think it does. I don't think the HDMI out has lag, I think just the capture. But the problem with the, 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 the lag is that it would mean that my voice would come like three seconds before the game feed, and that would be really bad, especially for a game where I'm like talking. Like, hey, you Pikachu has enough input problems, right? Yeah, I've always kind of like, like Vine Sauce does that. They have the the super edited videos where they just have the funniest bits and kind of like, you know, tell a little bit of a narrative and you know, it's like five minutes from like four hours of footage, and that's neat and all, but it's like I, I don't really get the views to justify that, and I don't really enjoy doing that a great deal like i did that for a yumi nikki stream just to see like if people would be into that and it actually got less views than just the raw <clears throat> live stream so that was the end of that basically you know what we should do to really celebrate today what should we do dare i ask does anybody use the twitch events by the way i noticed you can schedule twitch events like the YouTube scheduled things. And I like those, but I don't know if anybody actually uses them or they just like check in whenever. That seems to be mostly the Twitch cultures. You just check in whenever and, you know. You check in on regular people, you know, you'll, you'll already know their schedule. And for anyone else, you just happen to see them. Emoji only mode. Oh no. I don't even like normal emoji. But how would emoji only work with with the, the, the spinners? I keep trying to say fidget spinners when I say spinners. I hate I hate those things. Like not not really the the item themselves, but 
the, the ridiculous fame they've achieved for doing basically nothing. It's so weird. Like, the fidget cube, I get. The fidget cube seem really cool, and people seem to really enjoy it. And, like, the fidget spinners are just like, Yeah, it's a thing you spin, yay. It's the best thing ever. Let's never talk about the fidget cube again. It's like, what? What? Like, the fidget cube has, like, ideas, and does multiple things, and is really compact, and it's subtle. Ah, oh, senpai, we're late again. I feel like my head is gonna go through the ceiling in this area. Like, it feels very wrong. I feel like a tall person in a really small basement. Which reminds me, a friend of my sister's, he's like six foot, like, six or something. And the the ceiling in, in the basement of my parents' house is like, like, five, six or something. He looks like, he looks like he's in an Oompa Loompa house or something when he's in the basement. He's, it's pretty amazing. Here I come to break the illusion of emote only mode. I like how you can see that if you're watching the VOD, you're not going to get the joke at all. But if you're on if you're on Twitch, you just get spinners instead of loading spinners instead of the emotes. Also, I talked to media accounts after my issue last night. Like they 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 just had nothing. So I don't know, I really don't know. It really just seems like there's something weird about my internet connection where after about an hour or two, it just decides, no, we're gonna stream a lot less. And it sucks, but I can't do anything about it. The green void. This kind of reminds me of J Bubsy Visits the James Turtle Retrospective. This, this kind of feels like a thing that would be there. Shark in plastic with green light. Oh, by the way, what's the delay like anyway? Um, does Twitch have does Twitch have a thing for that? Is it does it seem faster than YouTube? Because I think YouTube used to be more higher latency, but I don't know if that's as true now. I do have I think I'm in high interaction mode. Also, do people have buffering? Like, I think buffering was always a problem with Twitch, but I think quality options seem to be more common now. Like, I see quality options, at least for my myself, and I assumed that I wouldn't be able to have quality options just from, like, on my own, right? Like, you guys get quality options? Where did the good textures go? I just realized that. We, we had good textures once. That's my, that's probably my biggest complaint about this game. We get good textures, and then we go right back to the normal ones. I didn't even get hit by the evil man. Eight seconds? That's not bad at all. Well, it's not bad by modern terms. It's like, it's not as good as Beam was at its height. But, uh... Oh, that actually reminds me, if I did go to Mixer, I could do the low interaction, or the low latency mode, I guess, if I were going to only stream to Mixer, but... I, I don't think I want to bother trying with that, because... If I'm only going to stream to one thing, it only really makes sense for it to either be, you know, where my other stuff is, which is YouTube, or the, you know, default platform, so to speak, which is Twitch. Why is that one immune? Wait a minute, Capitalist, that emote does not get loading spinnered. What's up with that? Is that a sub emote, maybe? Do sub emotes not get hit? Oh, Kappa HD goes through too. That's weird. KF fish. Oh, I want some story time. I have my phone ready too. Oh! <laughs> this was not planned. <laughs> fake! Fake! Alright, hold on. Wait, what? Did it go? I pressed the button. Did it go? It's not. Ah, fuck! Did somebody screenshot that? God damn it, it didn't work. I pressed the button to do the thing and it didn't go. I hate this. Google Translate app is like. like technologically amazing, but. 
garbage interaction wise. Oh, you screened it? Okay, hold on. This room is no longer in emote only mode. <laughs> you wait, you can put it in emote only? Wait. Let's just let this. Oh, this 90s CGI, amazing. I wonder how much this cost. Uh, sorry, I'm just waiting for the thing. I guess this went through because the Twitch Prime remotes. Huh. Does this go through? Huh. Yeah, I think it's only default emotes that get loading circled. Because, like, you're paying for the other ones, so it would be kind of rude. Okay, here we go, here we go. Um, we'll just let this go. It'll add to the story. Story time. Fleeing the lion. Is that what they're calling it this, these days? Flee a lion's escape. A lot of ships arrive at the harbor. Lion's parents and children are being chased. My father lion was taken to somewhere. Nobody lion runs around the harbor, pursued by the captain of the navy. At last it fell into the sea. I understand completely. Hey, Mr. Rosen. It also does, yeah, it does make sense what the messages are going for. You gotta pay. You gotta pay if you want your stuff to go through. I, I just want Mr. Face Man to be in, in, the, in the thing. We've seen Mr. Face Man a few times, but... I forgot emote only mode was even a thing. I thought that was a joke when I first heard about it. Then again, everything on Twitch sounds like a joke. Whee! There's no underside of that bridge. It's surprisingly common in old stuff like this, because, you know, less stuff to render. Well, only mode shouldn't be a thing. I agree. I don't see what, what the, that would even accomplish, like... Because you can't really say it's... Oh, no. Oh, we're going into the spaceship again! Why are we going into the spaceship? Wait, hold up, I have the map. Let's... Wait. The problem of the map is that I do not know... I have no frame of reference for any of this garbage. Hold on, let me zoom into the map. Like, without a proper frame of reference, the map... Is of little value. And it's very hard to tell where the crap is. Is the sun? Okay, the sun is basically in the, at the top of the sky. Or, yeah, that's what I was trying to say. The, the, if it's a moat only, like, there's no less capability for trolling. Like, in fact, probably the, the most common way of trolling, especially bigoted trolling, is through the emotes. So like, what is that supposed to solve? The fish. Is the fish? The fish are not on my map. Turtle is on. Shark River is on my map. Is this Shark River? I'm kind of surprised the fish are not on the map. Okay, the waterfall mouth. Let's see, I think this... Okay, the shipwreck. It should be in here? I think. Wait, no. Oh, you can just climb up in here. That's neat. This is not where I thought it was. Oh, crap, I hit a wall. Okay, well, uh oh. Who's that? Who is that? Where is that? Where is that coming from? Ah, <laughs> hello! What? Get out of here, Tengu! I don't think you would make it sound like that. I think it would be a bit louder, honestly. Come back here. Take me to your world. Well, I can't collide with him for some reason. That's odd. Usually if you touch an NBC, they'll immediately take you to another place. Huh. 
This game has so many what moments, it's really hard to tell what people are saying what about. Even with fairly brief lag, it's like, huh? That could have been like five different things. Alright, let's just leave here. The normal textures suck, why does it keep doing this to me? Nobody wants- oh wait, the giant fish are on my map. I'm st I'm just stupid. Oh. Yep, this guy's here. Hi, buddy. Oh, we get a really good picture of him today. He's going off into the wild green unknown. I'm kind of surprised there aren't more games trying to, like, go for this kind of aesthetic and thing. I think that would be... With how moderately popular, um, oops, walking sims are, you'd think it would be more of a thing to go for this sort of thing. I also really wish LSD revamped, like, had more people working on it or something. Is it a public repo, by the way? Generalized what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> what? No, I said it to say LSD. Oh, you have to click update information. God damn it. Whatever. Wait, is this Face Man? Oh, it's Mr. Face Man! He looks like a Pokemon. Hello. Share share your knowledge with me, oh kind one. Alright. Window to black space is up this way. We saw most of the items on the map, but I'm just kind of looking around. What aesthetic for FPS? No, the the lo-fi, surreal, crazy stuff. Some randomness thrown in there, too. It'd definitely be easier to explore if we're not random, but it kind of... It makes it more dreamy this way. <clears throat> Mr. Face Man. Window to space. I gotta go to space. I'm gonna go to space. Oh yes. This area always makes me feel like I'm playing Yumi Nikki. Which, by the way, I think we might just straight up play Yumi Nikki again this October. I'll find some new fan games and stuff to play as well. But I kind of just want to play it again. It was really good. Also, if anybody has magic secrets to oops into the ravine. Um, but yeah, I, I never got those things to work in Windows 10. Like a Twitch, your name is a different color each time you join. I think you can pick your color. Let me try. Yeah, like I picked green. I think if you don't select a color, it's always the same. But yeah. All right, let's save. Oh, man, we're, we're still a little bit under halfway through this game too, by the way. This game is ridiculously long. It's a whole year. Play Freedom Planet first. I don't know when we're gonna get to Freedom Planet, if we do. It's a little- oh! Mr. Demon Man! Eat my face, please. He's not eating my face. Boo. Ooh. Uh-oh. We're going back to space, Murph! Whoa. What the heck? Our home is called Bright Moon Cottage, by the way. I like how this intense music is going on. There's nothing here. Camel illusion. I think the UFO must be... No, not that way. Pit and temple. Weird. Uh, where's the... Even with a map, this game is freaking inscrutable and impossible to navigate in. I need to play Freedom Planet, it'd be interesting to hear your humorous take on dialogue and gameplay. Is it that funny, like, the dialogue and stuff? I, I only played it, like, I turned off the story thing and I just played the first uh, level or so. 
It seemed good. Like, I've... I haven't really heard any bad things about it, but, uh... Oh, there's the thing again. So that's... I was trying to find the UFO. Dialogue has its good moments. I usually play it in, like, a default mode when I do a video, so I'd probably, you know... Have the video or the dialogue on for that. But I'm just gonna take a quick peek at it. I'm usually pretty tired when I start playing new games and stuff, so I just. Unless it's a weekend or I'm doing a video, I usually just kinda chill with it. What is this? What is this garbage? It's freaking. Ah! Okay. The flower ate me. Oh, we're back here. Good. It's not the murder noise. Why does that noise exist? LSD prevent better not have that noise in it. That's the one part of the game they are absolutely 100% allowed to not emulate accurately. What is this garbage? Ah, my ears! What is this garbage? Just my reaction to most of this. But this is the best. This is this is not garbage. This is beautifulness. Aside from the squeaky noise, you know what's weird? I thoroughly like I, I kind of not ironically enjoy the horrible ear cleaning noise of the bridges, in the uh, grasslands. But but the squeaky noise is painful. You're blue now. That's my attack. Is this on PSX? Yes. The polygon should make that pretty clear. I kind of miss that. Like, it's a good thing. Like, have you ever realized how, um, way back in the day, um, hardware, like, old consoles had very, very, um, oh, I thought it would go on to the, uh, When I see this map, I want to feel like there's going to be like a JRPG like world map down below there and I'm like walking to the final boss or something. Oh, this game this game gives me so many good like PlayStation 1 vibes. They're good vibes, Brent. Uh what was I talking about? Um Oh, hey, Murder District. Ooh. Rave party in the Murder District. Or violence district, you know what I mean. There's a duck laser assaulting people at a rave. Ah, oh, crash. The beats were too fresh. The beats were so fresh they crashed the game. Amazing. Ugh. What was I talking about about old consoles? All right, so you know how PS1 has those wobbly polygons? Way back when, you could really tell what console a game was on by its um, by its graphics. You just kind of look at it and be like, yeah, that's a Genesis game. That's an SNES game. You know, that has kind of shit textures, but there's crisp polygons. That's a N64 game. That game has really crisp pixelated textures and wobbly polys. That's PlayStation 1. That game has square polygons. That's that's Saturn. Everything had a, had a real sense of... I don't know. It had, it had personality to it. And, uh... Now that graphics have kind of, you know, stabilized, there's less of that, which is, you know, a, a good thing, generally speaking, but... Oh yeah, that, that, that Mario jigsaw puzzle is atrocious. Whoever designed that should be fired. GameStop, is this a pre-order thing or something? Can you imagine putting this piece of garbage together? Hold on. They're giving away this. Like, 50% of it is solid red, which is not only extremely boring, it's going to be extremely painful to try to put together for no benefit. Like, it's... Nothing is going on in this. But, like... And it's a thousand pieces, by the way. Like, imagine all of the, like, Mario series enemies they could have crammed in the background. All the really cool background art they could have had. Um, 
all of the familiar Nintendo characters they could have put in there. No, it's just a black... God damn it. Um, it's just a blank red space. Have fun with that, kids. Might as well leave your kids with, like, I don't know, a, a burnout tire. Oh, yeah, that's what my theme always is. properly I can't believe there's a shake but there's a shake option but there's no horrible ear splitting noise option I wouldn't normally leave the view Bob on that's I think that's what shake is but I will for this game it kind of adds to it I think is the jigsaw thing like I, I know some people probably still you know surely some people still do basically everything but is the jigsaw, like, fad thing kind of over? Like, I haven't really seen... I don't know, it seemed to be bigger when I was, like, Tiny Bab. This game got it right, confirm access. And that's not... Not in the West, that's not really... That's the Japanese, that's more of a Japanese thing. It can kind of be either way, which is the problem. This area always has the most dramatic music for the most absolute nothing going on. And into the ravine. Oh, the turn pink. Oh, we're all the, we're over towards the dynamic. I still don't understand. I, I kind of feel like that stuff is a lie. The 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 aspects or whatever, because it doesn't really seem to do much. Oh, senior citizens. Yeah, I guess that would make some sense. Lo-fi, cheap way to entertain yourself for a while. Get them brain juices flowing. Oh, that that camel thing gives me some not entirely pleasant, not entirely unpleasant memories of uh, Catholic middle school with all of the freaking Christmas crap, the We Three Kings, and all that stuff. Oh, it's time for an ear cleaning. Are you ready to clean out your ears, children? Oh, yeah. LSD ASMR, 12 hours. Mm. What are we looking at here? Legend of Zelda puzzle. That's not as bad, I, I guess. It's not super interesting, but it's, it's okay. Why are, there, why are the defaults robots, by the way? The default Twitch things. I never, like, it doesn't really seem to entirely fit with their brand. Like, I mean, their brand is just kind of, ah. Their brand is just kind of purple and memes, but I never understood the robots too much. I guess it was a pretty early part of Twitch, and they just never kind of changed it. I think the Twitch, the turbo emotes looked a little less ugly. Do they still have those? Yeah, they do. These guys. No, no, just post it. Twitch, please. I don't know how to meme. I don't use... I don't really do the Twitch chat thing. So I... I only meant to put one, but... I don't know. I guess they have some nice UI elements so you can more easily spam. But I like those chat faces. They, they're literally chat faces. That's definitely the space needle. Or some kind of like... Yeah, that, that, that section's not loaded thing reminds me so much of Minecraft. This game always really makes me want to play Mega Man Legends. What a beautiful game. What a good game. I should stream that sometime soon. Yeah, I like the little chat faces that are just little chat bubbles. They're clean. They have personality. They're inoffensive. They're not weird. Like, the, the robots are a little bit weird. I just want to get going, game. See, this is, I get antsy when we're not getting the weird textures. Like, when there's not, like, a lady's censored face on the wall. Which is a real texture in this game, by the way. Oh! 
The Void of Doom. The Birds of Doom. Okay. The Void is more interesting. Oh crap. Why is there a blobfish emote? I'm not surprised actually, never mind. I just came from here, please. I wonder if there's cheat codes for this game for like Game Shark that like makes it always crazy. Let's ascend the tower again. Spelled Wednesday wrong. Oh, yeah. Oh, I always do that. Does anyone actually pronounce it Wednesday, by the way? I've always said Wednesday, and and that's just... Well, this is a freaking griffin demon! Was there always griffin pig demon in the, in the sky? Have I missed this before? I don't remember that. Maybe I always got here a little bit slow and I never saw him. I get distracted by the moon. Oh, by the way, I think mods can edit my stream thing, by the way, if you want to update, if you need to update, whatever. I think, anyway. I don't know. Let's get out of here. How do I... Sure. Uh, you... Okay, so you just click people's names to... Add a mod. You can half hear me see the D hear the D in Wednesday. I don't know. I have a Midwestern accent for whatever that's worth. It's just kind of the It's just kind of the no particularly unusual like no nothing particularly silly accent. At least as far as Americans are concerned. Alright, we're just gonna die. If there's no good textures, so we're just gonna die. I do want to see the end of this game eventually. Wednes Wednesday? I don't know, it doesn't come naturally to me. There was some game, or some game. There was some word that someone was very surprised to hear me pronounce in some way. I forget what it was. Oh, this is going crazy on the electric piano here. Oh, lay down that beat, boy. The other Tengus. Oh, there's small Tengus. It's so weird that there's a look behind you button. There's actually two look behind you buttons. So if you want to look behind you to the right, you can go do that. Like, what a weird game. Chills day. Yeah, I just kind of go for Wednesday chill streams. Um, Mondays are kind of like no-nos, like why bother? Tuesday, I don't know if that many people tend to watch on Tuesday. Usually the weekend gets a lot more. But it's kind of hard to measure because people, like, there's a bit of a random factor to it. Sometimes, um, there's the game factor to it. There's, you know, how much advanced knowledge do people have. It's hard to compare streams together. Let's look behind you button in Mirror's Edge. Oh yeah, I guess there is. That's for like people chasing you and stuff. I guess there is the the guy, the gray man. Ah, oh, it's hoopstick. Ah, oh, yeah, that's the stuff. None of this video games. Back when I was a kid in freaking 1904, you had hoopstick. That's all you needed. That's all you needed before you died of like cholera. Turning around, jumping off the walls. Huh. Never actually got very far. Whoa. Hello, Mr. Three-Eyed Minotaur Man. Um, I never got super far in, uh... 
Mirror's Edge. I do own it. I think I own it. I think I own it from PS Plus and I own it for like a $1 sale or something on PC. I'm just gonna await my doom as this Minotaur looms over us. It does have some kicking boots. It's like a kaiju movie now. Oh, he has, he actually has no leg, he has no feats. Huh. Where'd he go? Oh. I was just looking directly up through his leg hole. Huh. Well, that sure was a thing. Maybe it's a friend. Well, it didn't eat our face, so, I mean, that's close enough to a friend for me. Is this... Are we seeing that... Yeah, we're seeing her through that building. Huh. Something wrong with that? What's wrong with having see-through feet? I mean, that's... Seems normal to me. Maybe it's all the Homestar Runner I've watched, but... I have an affinity for the non-traditional anatomy. Is there a name for that hoop stick crap, by the way? Oh, whoa. Hey, let's go on the, uh... Can we trigger that thing? Did we? Whoa. Oh, no we didn't. Um, if you go on one of those, um, the Ferris wheel thing, it gives you an FMV. I was kind of trying to do that. Oh, it's beautiful music! Listen to this amazing music. The music of my people. Don't complain that it has a one second loop. It's beautiful. It is the epitome of our culture. Hoopstick? Is it just called hoopstick? I guess back in like the cholera days, you, you couldn't be too fancy with your words. Or you know, they'd draft you or something. This music is going to make me murder a chicken. Like, there's no reason for this. Hold on, I have to I have to see the king about this. King Moon, spare me from this torment. I'm the king now. This is Earth Radio, and now, here's human music. Do, 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 do. Human music, I like it. We're, we're being downloaded into into a robot body again. By the way, speaking of downloading into a robot body, how screwed up is that drilling noise in Earthbound when they put you in the robots? Like, that's, that is some screwed up stuff. The whole last hour of that game is some scarring material. It's pretty great. Hoop trundling? I do feel like we have a slightly less viewers on Twitch, but it's also we also kind of just started moving back over to Twitch. Like I said, I'll give Twitch a few weeks before I make any kind of final decision. I really don't want to go back to YouTube again and then have my video taken down again and then boom. That's just asinine. Ah oh, yes, it's day 100, nice. No, it's doing the thing again! Fuck off! Oh, you piece of shit! I hate the Google Translate app. It is, the UI is such garbage. I pressed the take a picture button and the image froze, but it did not analyze it. Did somebody get a thing? You got a screenshot? All right. It just, just take screenshots of those as they come up because this app is garbage. It's like the actual translation of an image in basically real time is so magical, but the, the interface is such garbage. So if you're trying to do it in real time, it's just a mess. By the way, I think the composer for this game made, um, is making like a new album of like, 
it could feel like remixes or something. Um, I don't remember the details. Is Cap Capitalist, you posted that in the Discord, didn't you? Do you have a link to that? I feel like this could be a, a music video. Just this crap. And now that I've said music video, I want to see Beavis and Butthead do a riff of this. That's the one chain of like the DVD Beavis and Butthead stuff. You don't get the, you don't get them making fun of the uh, the music videos. All right, we got the thing. In laughter, the spiritual dream. All right, it's story time. All right, Tucker and kids. The street that catches a frog is a deep river. Water comes around the chest. I found a small frog. I tried to catch the frog. I grasped the soft body of a frog. But I'm surprised at the feeling of bad feeling. It's deep. Sometimes you are surprised by the feeling of bad feeling. It's, you think it's going to be good, good feeling, but then it's bad feeling. Oh, you found the- oh yeah, here it is. Yeah, that's the- Capitalist just posted the link to it. Object lists, classic ambient works, and more. All original tracks were recorded in 1982. Oh! Cool. But yeah, that's the, uh... That's the composer of this, and the, uh... That's kind of the- is that the composer's, like, symbol then? Or is that made for the game? Because we- obviously we saw that in the last SM FMV. Um... It's sort of, it's the, it's kind of the thing of that. Oops. We hit a wall. Coming this year in Japan and Europe only. Oh yeah, you mentioned that. That's... Whatever. Why Europe? Like, like Japan only is one... Th oh. Hey, Barkeep. Um, how, how, how you doing? You, uh, you come here often? He's trying to flee, but he knows. He, he's trying to flee his obligations, but his job has boxed him in. Into the job of, of, oh, he's, he's dead. He's just dead. Uh, he's, that uh, yeah. I, I guess you could call it a dead-end job. I believe this is just assembly likes to use. Use a lot in Eastern Mind. Hey, well, what is Eastern Mind? Eastern Mind? Eastern Mind, the Lost Souls of Tong Yu. Japanese point and click game. Oh, right. Is this something you can, like, get a copy of? What, what was this even for? Eastern Mind. I'm just going to fall into an abyss. Macintosh Windows. If I can find a, a copy of that, I'll play that. <laughs> Come here often, barkeep. I work here. Dies. It's on Windows too, apparently. Eastern Mind has some very good images, though. Um... Here you go, this guy. Mr. Mr. Eyeface. Oh, we got the FMVs. Whew! Some jazz. Beautiful. I think we've seen pretty much all the FMVs at this point. Remember when we just got like five solid minutes of FMVs for some reason? All right, keep saving, keep saving. Oh, this is an English, oh, right. it didn't even occur to me that it would be, well, I'm playing this in Japanese, not that it matters. An English translation PC port in, followed in 1995. Game is difficult to purchase. I imagine most things that only came out in 1995 and were not released on digital stores are pretty difficult to purchase. Unfortunately, really do wish we preserved games better. Like, 
Like, can you imagine if books were as hard to get, like, old books were as hard to get as video games are? Like, oh, To Kill a Mockingbird. That's a pretty old book. You're gonna have a lot of trouble finding that one. Yeah. Costs about $200 to get an original, you know, book cartridge. I do like the images I'm seeing from Eastern Mind. I definitely need... Oh, I like this guy. Not at all phallic tentacle hands, man. Amazing. I, I have to get a copy of this. That looks great. It's not going to be as easy to get as LSD. LSD, this is just... I got this for like... 500 yen. Um, on Japanese PSN. Alright, let's just keep on going then. Whoa, 12 clips. It does tell you when people do clips. Editing. I don't know if I have access to those clips. I assume I would. Oh god, what? No. No. He's here. We gotta go. Okay. Found a tumbler that has a link to a mirror of it and you'll need DOSBox. Yeah, I have DOSBox for sure. Send me that on Discord, uh, capitalist. I guess it'd be DOS makes sense. What is this? Oh, they're the lions! They're all glitchy! It's kind of funny, but DOS applications are actually way easier. Ah! <laughs> I forgot they like lunge at you in a way that makes no sense whatsoever. Um. What was I saying? Oh yeah, but DOS applications are easier to run because of DOSBox than 16-bit Windows applications. Which are kind of the one thing that's kind of like forgotten. Because 32-bit stuff you can run fine on x64. 32-bit, or 64-bit, or 16-bit, whatever amount of bits. The old ones. Those are the pain in the butt. And I think Windows 3.1 stuff might be even harder to run. Does Windows 3.1 stuff run on 16-bit, like, Windows, like, 95 and stuff? A very thick fog at the, uh, Murder Amusement Park today. This place doesn't usually have the Japanese text symbols. Hmm. Ah, yes, the trumpet time. That's how you trumpet, my children. Take me to your world of trumpets. Imbibe me with your dreams. Whoa. Blue. I think I just blew myself. Oh. There we are. Where is that? I want to go on a Ferris wheel ride. Here we go. Can we do this? Ferris wheel, please. Will this do the FMV? I want to find all the FMVs. There should be a speedrun category for this. All FMVs. It would probably still take hours because this game is... Well, I don't know how manipulatable this game is. Speedrunners might find a way. I doubt many people do speedrun it. You know, you're making great sequels this game. Exosuits and laser guns. Now you're thinking like EA. Hello, Mr. Sun. <laughs> okay. Its face is almost completely gone now. Come on. Oh, we're falling down the staircase again. Why is it so foggy today? Yeah, I'm just gonna go die until it's less foggy. I'll be fine. Oh, we're all the way- oh! Okay, this better be something amazing because we're all the way over a dynamic. I'm so upset that you can't save like separate slots for this. That's weird. Alright, everything is dynamic. We're crazy dynamic. Whoa. This music is crazy dynamic. Aw, oh, fuck! <laughs> Where am 
reloading that. We're, we're reloading that. No, I have to see fully dynamic. <laughs> it spawned me on the edge. Please. What? No. Yes. Ugh. My neck has been so stiff and only on like one side. I've got like a crick in like one side. Alright. The music is very dynamic. I'll give it that. Waiting for a sequel that's called PCP. Pleasant Cerebral Peepus. Okay, where is the where's the dynamicness? Show me the real dynamic stuff. Show me the dynamic murder district. What? What? Did it die? I lost my signal. Oh. Did it crash? What did it do? Hold on. Oh. Yeah, this is why I don't use this HDMI splitter anymore. It splits HD. It splits. Uh, it strips HTCP. But, but, it has issues. Oh, tiny turtle now. I love turtle. Oh, blood. Turtle ate us. Oh, god damn it! Hold on. HDMI thing. I need to get. I have some other splitters that I have that work. I'm. I, I'm so I have some two by one splitters that work just fine. But I use both of them for my PC setup, which is more complicated than you would think would be necessary. But it is necessary. Hey, Kigra. Oh, fucking hell. I'm not sure this is gonna work anymore. It's, it's HDMI splitter. I don't know why it's bugging out, because it's sitting perfectly still. Well, I was thinking of quitting soon. Ah, oh, god damn it. Uh, okay, yeah, I, I think the stream might be over at this point. Um, cause I was kind of thinking it's stopping at some point here, soonish. Um. Yeah, I think I just need to get another one of those 1x2 HDMI splitters so I can use it. Yeah, I'll keep going until it starts cutting out again, but if it does... Uh, oh. Just the day. Well, that sucked! What is this dynamic shit? That, that was not dynamic at all. And then it immediately warps you back to the middle. I, I call bullcrap on this whole... Oh, shit. I call bullcrap on the whole... Like, concept. Oh, fuck. Oh, God damn it, I hate you. Ah, oh, no! Okay, hold on. I think I got it. Oh my god, I hate this app. If you click the back button... When you like, if you take a screenshot too early, it takes you back two layers instead of one in the app. It's really annoying. My dead day, I decided to die after a few days. <laughs> That's the best sentence I've ever read. My dead day, I decided to die after a few days. This is fate. The day to die is 26 days. Even if you want to stop now, it is no use. <laughs> best. I have decided to die after a few days. Amazing. <coughs> I'm just gonna chill out and die in a few days, it's fine. See ya. <laughs> we've made some progress, so we've made like 10 days. Well, more than 10 days. Because I remember it being day 169. Alright. We're gonna go until we get another no signal. I drew the bar moment, but the pick is bad. Why is it so foggy? 
It's foggy inside my house. I'm not sure that's supposed to happen. Clipped it. I guess clipping the things with me. Ah! Yeah, I got it. Oh. Teddy, no! Teddy, please! Teddy, don't! No! Beautiful. I really like the pink water. Oh god, what? I didn't even move. Alright, I'm on the death the death tiles. I'm just gonna show you this. This is this is from Unplugged Comic. <laughs> you uh come here often? I work here. Did is he is he dead? <laughs> I like the little shot glass. <laughs> she did. Don't you hate it when the- oh god. It'll be over soon, my children, I'm sorry. <laughs> you can't show me fan art and expect me not to show it. That's what fan art is for. Oh god. Ah, oh, I wanted to go to that thing over there. Bad art skills are still better than my art skills. Oh no. Oh Teddy, please. Teddy, we had this conversation. Why is it so foggy in my goddamn house, Teddy? I hate this teddy bear. Bill the bear told me not to use this, the, the murderer chip. Did it anyway. I regret it. I regret everything. I'm just gonna let the beans train take my life and my freedom. Beans train, take me away. Take me to the bean zone. Beans train, please. Okay, this is, there's no beans train today. Yeah, the only thing you can do to make your art better is just, you just gotta draw a lot. Oh. Every card I draw looks like a hearse. Is Build Bear Squirtles? Ah oh, yes, it's violence district. I was hoping we'd see this at least one more time before the stream went to crap because of the stupid thing. I just have a old bad HDMI splitters are the sort of thing where like I don't know, it's all the same crap but rebranded, and some of them seem to be really crap quality, and you really can't tell until you buy them. And there's HDMI matrixes, which I kind of need because I have splitters and switches, and HDMI matrix is kind of both. But the HDMI matrixes. I need are like two hundred dollars, cause I need at least five inputs and at least three or four outputs, and that's apparently just too much. Like I can get a five in um, splitter for our switch for like ten dollars. Oh, there's a plane! Oh, he's dead. Rest in pieces. Oh, this then you traced it? Aw, oh, rude. I used to- I talked about this last stream, I think. Oh god. The loudest floor ever. Um, gong floor. Let's see if the car crack happens, too. Must not be the car wreck today. Um, I used to draw it kind of okay way back in high school. I don't think it would be anywhere near that level if I started now, but... Uh, drawing is one of those things I wish I could do, but I don't think... I really don't have the time to invest into it, unfortunately. Ooh, car. Oh! Crash. Oh, no. Why is it not doing the fade out anymore? It's supposed to fade out when you wake up. I guess I should learn to draw like tap taps and Kirby's and other spheroid regions. A brown region with points. I think I could probably draw a curb. That's probably about it. The yeah, Aquatine Teen Hunger Force is an old TV show. I'll always remember it because they had like an LED thing for Aquatine Hunger Force advertising it. 
and everyone thought it was a bomb because anything with wires is a bomb. Like you open up your computer, there's a bomb in there because there's wires. You open up your PlayStation, there's a bomb in there. Your dad's laptop is a bomb. You you open your car's hood, somebody's put a bomb in there. Everything's a bomb. So uh, that was like 2012 or whatever. So people were still being idiots over 9/11. They're still being idiots over 9/11, but uh, even more so. Oh, hello. How do you guys do? So so is one of your faces an asshole or how does that work? Oh, you, you gotta go. It's is that too personal of a question? No, no. I swear I didn't mean anything by it. I, it's not racist. It's just, I'm just curious. Oh, that's a friendship lost. Oh my God, JC, a bomb, a bomb. Horses. These horses are also bombs. No, please take me with you. Take me to the verdant plains of your dreams. No, no, don't space away at the teleport. Aw, oh, I hate teleport horses. I'm racist against teleport horses. Huh. Well, it seems our no signal issue has fixed itself briefly. Oh, yeah, this is like an Eastern Mind, like, Tumblr thing. I never use Tumblr, and every once in a while I get reminded of Tumblr. And then I'm usually very quickly reminded of why I don't use Tumblr. Read me this tap tap. Where can you find several, finish several books before you finish the sentence? I don't know. Who's creaking? Whose granny is coming over to visit? Oh, it's Minotaur with with thing. Collaborative emote only art project. Oh, space aliens! Give me my freedom. Why are you pink? I guess everything's pink today. It's pink day or pink hour. That that demo of that one game. No, take me with you, please. Take me to your leader. Aw, oh, I'm not a cow, so you don't abduct me. I see how it is. Oh. Wait, what, you think I'm not pretty enough to probe? What is this? What is this garbage? Please. Oh. They, they want nothing to do with me. I can't believe this crap. Where's the space window? I want to go to space window again. It's a good window, Brent. Yeah, I know Pink Hour. I played that. Yeah, Pink Hour and Carol Blaster are both good. Pink Hour is like a demo, not, um... It's like a, one of those things where it's a demo that's not in the game. It's like its own separate thing. It's neat. I'd play it whether you're going to buy it or not. Whether you're going to buy Carol Blaster or not. But obviously if you like it, you know, you'd like Carol Blaster. Oops. There's another version of Pink Hour, Pink Heaven. Oh yeah, I think I played... Are those two different things? I think I played Pink Heaven, not Pink Hour. I played whichever one was on Steam. I guess they're probably both on Steam by now. But I, I first heard about one on Steam and I played that, and then I played Carol Blaster. I have a video of Carol Blaster, actually. Well, a video, a series or whatever. I didn't beat the hard mode, the overtime mode. But, uh... I wonder how free games work with Steam Direct. I really wish there was, like, there's some free games I really wish would get on Steam. Like, um, 
Like, it would be amazing to have off on Steam. Oh, it's NBC time. The answer is prison. Oh. It's the Love Shack. Let's go to the Love Shack. It's gonna be lovely. What's in the Love Shack? Inside the Love Shack is a blue void! Oh god, not you. John from Mississippi, you've won a new blue void! Come on down! Ah, uh, T- er, what do they call those? Game shows. I like how he just honks 18 billion times. Whee! He does a freaking sick flip, too. Not flip, but like... He jumps. His car jumps. He's like a video game car. Oh no. Oh no, please. Someone save me. Not the not the not the gray man. Oh, Blue Void is back. Blood on the Walls is back. Oh, this reminds me of Dot Hack 2. This keeps reminding me of so many cool things. I want to play all of them. Alright, Mr. Elephant Man. Alright, into the ravine. I really want to play that first Dot Hack series. I wonder if they'll remake it, because they're, they're re. Well, I guess remastering, probably, more likely the, uh, the GU series. Which would be is an easier game to remaster. I I can't fault them too much, but I really want those first games. Because those first games could really do with a retouch. They were sort of early PlayStation 2. Well, maybe not early, early, but uh, they had a lot rougher gameplay than GU. Also, I think I lost like half of my GU save file because it was on my... I played that on my PS3 by the end. And um, my PS3, my first PS3 had the yellow light of death, so I lost all my PS2 saves. That that was that pissed me off because the thing about the PlayStation 2 and the PlayStation 3, um, you can back up your save files, but it encrypts them, and certain things only back up to that exact PS3. So PS3 games could be backed up to any other PS3, as long as you had that same user account. But your PS1 and PS2 games were gone, like your save files. And, ugh. I've always been, I, I have my dead PS3, and I think with like a heat gun, you can like briefly bring it back to life to try to save the files off it, but I, opening up a PS3 is a complete nightmare and I've just never committed to it. Ooh. I ain't talking. I feel like we're playing a really intense mini game in some other game. All right, let's see if the bartender's here today. I like the crash games when I was younger. Should I again? Well, there is that crash remake, so it's a perfect time to replay. Oh god! <laughs> he just skewed into. He just split himself into one dimension. Like that's not even two dimensional. That's one dimension. I'm not sure if that's better or worse than death. I'm gonna say worse. I'm gonna say it's worse than death, really. Why does this keep happening when I approach bartenders? Surely it's not me. It's obviously there. Ah. It reminds me of that Rick and Morty adventure game, the Rush License Adventure. It's the thing where Morty loses his D. He's like, you're 2D, Morty. Or no, he's 1D. It's like, you gotta get your D back, Morty. I think I've said this before, but it sounds like a 90s like sitcom or cartoon music. It's gonna get started. What are these clips that are being shared? Oh, was that the 1D person? Why is, it, why is his face a bit more clear? Or is it the same and I just can't tell? Ugh, 
I'm all sniffly today. I guess I haven't been that today. Ooh, FMV time. This is the only game that can make me super excited for FMVs. I had a, f a friend of mine was like, uh, back in college, he was like, oh man, I hope with like PS3 and Xbox 360, like every game can have like FMV quality stuff. It's like, no, I want freaking, everything should be in-game graphics. But yeah, aliens, they're, they're out there at the shopping center for high quality discounts on bags. Oops. Huh. This map is extraordinarily useless in retrospect. You, you, you only get like 10 minutes to move around, and it usually takes you at least 5 to figure out where you are, if you're even on the outdoors map. That's so hard. Even when you- I play this game so much, it's like my 8th stream of it. It's still a mess trying to navigate outside. Wait, what's that? Oh, it's Kimono Lady. Here, Kimono Lady, let us fuse our existences. See, this is what I'm talking about with the, the textures. You get normal crap for 10, 15 days. You get, you get words textures for 10 days. Oh, dog. Let me get eaten by a dog. Um, you get kind of wacky textures. I'm in the floor. Okay, I'm not. I'm out of the floor. You get kind of wacky textures for like two days. Then you get crazy textures for one day. And then it's back to normal. That sucks. I want ten days of crazy. They should at least be even. Ah, oh, you son of a butt. No. I refuse. I refuse. I wonder how exactly the music stuff is composed, because it is procedural, but obviously there's, you know, samples and stuff. I wonder if there's, like, pre-made... Yeah, some stuff seems to be pre-made riffs and stuff. Like, it's not just completely random sampling. So I wonder exactly how that all works. I just fell into the infant void. Oh, wait, no, I, I didn't. Cube... Where's Hoopstick? Where's freaking Hoopstick? I need Hoop. Where's Hoop? There, there's the Hoopstick. Yeah, there's the stuff. I would love a No Man's Sky game like this. Way more crazy. I still never played No Man's Sky. I hear it has like all kinds of ridiculous crap now, like base building and stuff. Like, how? Ooh, now this is a good one. Kya! I'm late! Oh! I'm really late! No! Senpai! Look how late. Oh, it, I'm a little bit less speedy now, but. This, this floor texture, I want this floor texture everywhere. You should, it's pretty good now. Yeah, I'm just never sure whether I want to get on PS4, or PS3, or whatever, or PS, PC. I can't believe Senpai is rejecting me. He's like rejecting me 500 feet backwards. Oh, we got a big gate in bed. Excuse? There you go. Oh, I'm all itchy. The Parker, like, I was like sniffly earlier, and now the Parker fur is getting to me as well. Oh, there's the something chip. Oh no, you can't walk up to it. You can't find Game Shark codes for it. Yeah, it was a Japanese only game, and I'm not sure if Game Shark really did. Like, I'm not sure if they had a Japanese presence. Ugh, neck, please. Why are you so crickety? Alright, I think I'm done for the night. Thanks for watching. I'm not sure what to stream next. Um, I might just stream some Horizon or whatever I happen to be playing Friday night. I think I'll stream Friday. Um, I'm just not entirely sure what. 
So again, 6 p.m. Central, that's when I always stream. Um, I should stream Kirby games again. I think, I never streamed Rainbow Curse. I think I should, I'll get back to Kirby streams at some point. Uh, trying to think of something else. Eh, well, see you some, with something Friday. But yeah, thanks for watching everybody. Yeah, I'll keep Freedom Planet in mind, but I don't know. Probably not imminently. <laughs>